how to sum in Excel with a specific criteria, the cells that has, that contains a specific word. Here through this list with a lot of different products, I have, let's say, protein powder, vanilla protein powder, strawberry protein powder, and on and on, many variations of the protein. But I want to add up all those values that correspond to the protein. How can I do it? Of course, I can use the sum if function to sum whenever the value matches a specific criteria. But in this scenario right here, I have many variations of the protein word. So let's say here, I uh, want to use this smaller example, and then we can move on to main one. I think it's going to be easier to understand with this radical example right here. And then we move on to the, the next one. So as the total, I want to use the equal sign, the sum if function, one, two, to add up all those values that match with a specific criteria. As the range, the first argument that I have, I want to use the names protein, one, two, three, protein, and protein ABC. And then comma, my criteria is going to be open quotations mark, protein, close quotations mark, comma, the sum range is going to be where I have the values. Close parentheses and then press enter. As you guys can see, the result is equal to 50 because as I'm using protein as criteria, the only cell where I have protein is the first one, protein equal to 50. Oh, but I'm in the second cell and I'm in the third one, you also have the protein word within the cell. Okay, I agree with you, but uh, we can't match, let's say, protein with one, two, three protein or with protein ABC. It doesn't match. This is why I only got 50 as the result and not all those values. But uh, if I want to match the protein word with anything that is comes before it and with everything that comes after it, I can use the asterisk before the word and after the word. So here within the, the function one, two, to open, before the protein word, I'm gonna use the asterisk. I'm gonna press enter. And as you can see, now the addition is equal to 150 because now I'm having protein and everything that comes before it. But I should also add anything that comes after it. I can again double click in the, the function and after the protein word, I can append another asterisk and then press enter. Now I have here the correct result, the addition of all those values that match with the protein word. And doesn't matter if there is something before the protein or something after protein, or if it's just protein, it's going to work in the same way. Now let's move on to the main example that is to use in this list that I have. Equal sign sum if function. One, two, and uh, as the same way as before, I want to select here the range. And the range that I want to use, it can be either a small range like this, a specific one, or I can select the, the entire column C, where I have the products that I want to use as the criteria. Choma, my criteria is going to be open quotations, and then it's very important to use the asterisk before the word. I want to use protein, asterisk, and then close quotations. Choma, the sum range is going to be the total column, the column E, and then close parentheses and then press enter. And here I got the correct result. So this is how we can use the sum if function to match everything that contains a specific word. So it doesn't matter if you have the word itself or if you have variations of this specific word. I hope this video can help you out. And if you have any questions or any suggestions to the next videos, let me know, comment down below. And I see you tomorrow as every day has a new video. I see you there.